Yo, what? What's going on, man? Hey there, guys. Welcome to San Isidro, California. This is my hotel room here. 207. I'm going to go in a little later and show it to you guys. Housekeeping is cleaning up. It's beautiful. They got a swimming pool. I'm so sorry I didn't get into the pool. I wanted to get in there. Just no time because I got to make vlogs for you guys. I got to film. And when I'm not filming, I'm editing. And when I'm not editing, I'm sleeping. I eat very little. Let me take you into the pool area, show you what it looks like. Very nice pool here. Very, very nice. And my room is right in front of the pool. Sadly, I did not get to use this beautiful pool. I wish I did. They got nice lounging chairs out here. I guess the pool pumps are in there. See, nice lounging area for hanging out. It's great. We stayed here a couple of years ago. I was kind of seedy back then. But I was talking to one of the own, not one of the only one of the workers in a previous video, see, and he, he told me about it. But he said new management or new owners, they got it all cleaned up, fixed up. They got rid of the drug users. Yeah, when we were staying here years ago, man, <laughs> it smelled. It smelled like weed all day long. It was bad. Look, there's some nice sitting areas out here. I didn't even get to enjoy any of this. Because I've been so busy working and filming for you guys. Right over there, that's a gas station and a convenience store. That's where I buy, you can buy your cup of soup, sausages, big ass burgers, Cokes, beers, everything they got. Liquor store, they got everything over there. That's where I went. Buy my little snacks. I only been to a restaurant so far once. I went to Denny's. Check it out in yesterday's video. And then um, I ate a burrito. No, that was the day before yesterday's video. In yesterday's video, I ate a burrito. Burrito. They call it burro. I didn't know what a burro was. That's, I guess that's Mexican gringo for burrito. But yeah, let me show you a little bit more. I'm so sorry I didn't go swimming. I should have. Here in this part of the world, North America, when you have a swimming pool, you need to have a fence around it. That's the law. And a fence with opening that's locked and high enough so that kids can't get, go in there and fall into the pool and drown. That's that's the law here. That's what you gotta do. Hello. Hi. That's the law here. So that's why they have this fence around the pool. Housekeeping up there cleaning. Sounds like the laundry room. Let me go take a peep in the back. Oh, I remember when we stayed here the last time. Yeah, we parked in the back here. Ah, yeah, I remember that. That was really catchy. We stayed in one of those rooms there and the people hanging out on those stairs, smoking that crap that they smoke, you know. I still like the hotel though. I still like that. That's why I came back. Maybe we're on that side, I don't know. Sniffing, a, sniffing, and I think I can smell it in the air. No, no. Well, we stayed somewhere, one of these rooms. I don't know if it was that side, this side. I went, I went and complained to the management. I told him, you know, there's some sketchy looking homeless people hanging out. But it's nice now. It is nice, highly recommended this hotel. Let me go to, oh, shit. I just about tripped on that, uh, just about fell. Your housekeeping is cleaning, so a lot of garbage. This is the laundry room. Back to the pool area. 
This is nice. Let me show you what it looks like from outside. This is here from outside, guys. Yesterday's video, I was walking along there. I went down that way. Video the day before, I went down that way. Here's money exchange. This here is a gas station and convenience store. There's another gas station convenience store there. This is it here. Motel Six Suites. This convenience store is really good. That one there is back there is a little smaller. This one is really good. They got they got everything in there. I don't remember if I filmed in there or not. Up there is a highway going to Tijuana. That way, Tijuana, San Diego. Yeah, so here is a Shell gas station. Yeah, yesterday's video I walked down that way. Day before yesterday's video I walked that way. Food Mart. So this is the place guys. This is the place to be. When you're going to be going over the border, if you're going to cross the border into Tijuana, I recommend you stay here. Prices are good. The rooms are clean. Management is friendly. They got a swimming pool. Convenience store. Right across the street. Down the road there, I don't know if you could see it here. I'll see if I could zoom in. There's a Denny's. Casa de Cambio. I mean, everything here, guys. This is the place. Studio Motel 6 Suites. I love it. I love it. I wish I could stay here like a whole month, but I can't. I gotta keep on traveling, guys. But let me take you into the front desk and show you guys the front desk here at the office. Office, yeah. This here, guys, is the office. They're busy right now, so let to check the people in and I'll be right back. Guys, so um, the people said they don't mind being on camera, getting filmed, so this here is the office where you check in. Got the big six. See, this is what it's called. Studio Six Suites. Everything available there. It's really nice. You guys are staying in a good place. This place is nice. Oh, thank you. I stayed here years ago before it was remodeled and it was bad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you, you know about that, true? It was like really bad. It was like, holy shit. <laughs> I say, what? I was two or three years ago. I forgot what it was. But there are a lot of people smoking weed in the back and <laughs> living under the stairs. And it's totally, re totally remodeled. I was a little scared. I was a little scared to come, but. When I came, I, I love it now, man. You guys yeah. really. Oh, yeah. We keep it up now. Yeah, you did a good job. Clean it out, chased away all the bums. Yeah, you're gonna be happy. You're gonna be happy staying here. Where are you yeah. from? Uh, well, originally from Los Angeles. Oh, from LA. Yeah, but I'm just coming back from Mexico. Oh, come back from Mexico. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I I live in Mexico right now. I'm living in the Yucatan. Like, oh wow. In Merida, Yucatan. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. I was freezing last night. It was down to 65. Oh, wow. I was freezing. I got used to the heat. This one for you. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, guys. So this this is this is a nice place. You got coffee in the morning. Do you, do you guys give like breakfast in the morning here too? We only have coffee in the morning. Yeah. Oh, only coffee. I saw a big pizza here yesterday. Oh, that was for uh, all of the employees. Oh, for all the employees. I saw a giant box like that big. Yeah. Oh. So you could get your coffee here, plus you got your coffee in your room. Yes, for 2.30. And open 24 hours a day. Yes. And these guys take care of you. And, and what I did, guys, why I came here, I needed a computer. I didn't want to be too long. I needed to get it quick. So what I did, I ordered it on Amazon. I had it shipped here. Yeah, you look up guests. And they don't really know me or nothing, but I give them a call on the phone and say, hey, I'm getting some packages from Amazon. Please accept them. 
put them away because I'm going to be arriving in a couple of, I gotta go this week, I like, I gotta be arriving a couple of days. They saved the boxes for me. And that's how I ended up here. So what's, you, what's your guys' name? I'm Orlando. Orlando? Martin. And Martin. So they took we care of the box. you here yeah. the Studio 6. Studio 6, man. I, I, you, this place is really nice now. Highly recommend it. I'm making a video for anybody traveling to Mexico. You know, you don't want to drive into Tijuana late at night. You want to go early in the morning. Yep. Stay the night here, and then early in the morning, you take off for the border. You can ask her also. Yeah. She's been a customer more than a year, right? Really? More than a year? Wow. Where do you live? Uh, here. Here? Uh, here? Yeah. Oh, and you stay, you stay here all the time? Yeah. Wow. I'm currently looking for a place to live. Oh, oh, you're staying in the hotel for more than a year. Wow. <laughs> I'd love to one stay. Day at a time, but, uh, yeah, one day at a time, yeah, yeah. While, while you look for a job and a place to rent and all that stuff. Yep. Cool. Okay. Very nice. Thank you. I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't mind staying here a whole year myself. I wish I didn't have to go back. Yeah, the only thing is you gotta stay 21 days uh, at a month, then yeah. go check out, come back again. Uh huh, yeah, great. Okay, guys, so this is the place, highly recommended. Studio 6. Studio 6 Suites. Give me the address. Today, via the San Isidro, San okay. Isidro, California. There you guys know. All right, this is the place. Thanks for watching the video. Until next time, from everybody here at Studio 6. Guys, let's head up. Let's head up to the room. Let me show you the room. Right up there. My room is right up there. Hola, quiero saludar la cámara. Vas a salir en YouTube. Buenos días, ¿cómo están? Los cuartos están muy, muy limpios. Okay. Gracias. Gracias para Gracias. dejarlo así. Bye. Okay. Buen día. Yeah, heading up to the room, guys. Okay. Here we go to the room. Guys, I love it here. I love it here. Watching the world go by. Guys, this is the room. 207. Let me show you what it looks like. Very nice room. Let me sit here in the corner. Stand, sit here. Good. Down the corner, you got AC and heater. I actually had the heater on last night because I was really, I was freezing, man. It was cold. It was down to like 65 or something like that. So you got a big bed, huge bed. See, right now I have it on cold. But last night I had it on this. I had the heater on. Outlets. This here is mine. I keep, keep that because I always need lots of USBs. They have a nice little light behind the bed if you want a little light, king size bed. They've got a TV. Let me turn it on for you guys. TV, you know, we have better TV at our house because we got a fire stick. We've got hundreds and hundreds of channels. Not hundreds, thousands of channels. They got good locks. Got this lock here. You got another deadbolt here. There's a window, but you can't have the window open because, you know, people can look in outside, from outside. Big TV. There's a computer, I'm editing some video. I got all my other stuff, too much stuff. They have a refrigerator. Got my Coke Zero, that's all that's left. Got a microwave, works good. I heat up my big ass burger. I'll put the picture right here. Big ass burger, I heat it up in there. I bought myself some forks, not because I need a fork, but I need a knife to open up the boxes from Amazon. <laughs> that box from Amazon. I couldn't open it up, I had nothing sharp and pointy. So I bought myself a pack of forks. I broke one fork off with the sharp edge of the plastic thing. And I bought myself a pack of cups not realizing 
they give you some cups to the room. Coffee maker, I guess that's for ice. They've got um, coffee. They've got creamers. Oh. Cool. Oh. Oh, these are like pods. Coffee pods. Wow. Oh, I bought myself a hot sauce. Frank's Red Hot. And I got a little closet area there. I got my t-shirts hanging there from my trip. There's an ironing board, which I don't use. I'm an iron. That's the box that my computer came in. And the other stuff. Here's my backpack. Nice little sink area with a big mirror. Yo, boy, what's going on there? And I got a nice shower. Okay. Glass door, nice toilet, couple of towels, extra toilet paper, vent fan to get rid of stinky. It's nice, guys. Very, very nice. Night table on each end of the, each side of the bed. I got my chanclas, chanclas right there. You know, Belizean can't travel without the chanclas. You know how the thing go. Yeah, so this is, this is the room, guys. This um, air conditioner, it, it makes a little rattling noise, if you listen. Which doesn't bother me because um, I like a little noise when I sleep. I prefer a fan that makes a little noise than a fan that's too quiet. So this is the room, guys. Very nice. If you are in the San Isidro area, if you're gonna be crossing the border into Tijuana, Mexico I recommend you stay here it's 80 some bucks a night US one or two persons I guess more people they charge extra I've stayed here before eh, a few years ago it was a little rough back then it's been totally totally renovated totally remodeled it's awesome now it is, it's a good hotel. I give it a one thumb, two thumbs up. Yeah, definitely. Stay here, guys. Studio, it's called Studio 6. It's a Motel 6, but it's Studio Motel 6 because they've got the fridge, they got the microwave. I guess that makes it a studio. <laughs> I don't know, but anyway, yeah. I recommend it, guys. It's good, it's great. It is great. Internet is good. This is the computer I got, guys. I'm not too happy with it. It's rendering a little bit slow. I think it should have been faster. But what can I do? Or maybe it's just a big file. Anyway, guys, yeah, I do recommend this hotel. Studio 6, Motel Studio 6, or Studio Motel 6, I don't know. I'm gonna find out exactly. Studio Motel 6. Yeah, that's what it says on the paper. Guys, stay here. When you're in San Isidro, you're going over the border because you don't want to you don't want to travel into um, Tijuana at night. You don't want to go into Tijuana at night. No, it's it's it could be dangerous. So you want to cross the border early in the morning and head into Mexico early in the morning so you can get as far away from the northern Mexico part as you can, as soon as you can. So this is the place guys, Studio Motel 6. Great place. I recommend it. I've been here a few days and I love it now. What? What? Oh, spam, spam. Call this number and spam him back, guys. I keep getting spam calls from Mexico. So guys, get out of my room. I'm kicking you out. The outside is beautiful and the sun is shining. Thanks for watching the video. Bye bye. Look at the beautiful weather out there. That's where you should be exploring. Driving to Tijuana, gas station with convenience store right over there. 
Swimming pool here.